What's going on guys? I got a little challenge for you. I want to see if you can count how many squares that you see on the chessboard. I even gave you a hint. The answer is not 64. One of my friends showed me this problem and I thought it was pretty cool to share with you guys. It's really going to show you how to think mathematically as well as how to gather and organize your thoughts in a mathematical process. So if you're a teacher out there, give this problem to your students. And if you're bored and you can't sleep, see if you can figure this out. Just pause the video and play it back when you're ready for an explanation. Alright, let's go over this answer really quick. Let's start with the obvious. If you count individual squares, the little squares, there are 64. I hope you didn't count one by one because you could just count the row and the column and multiply them together. 8 times 8 and we get 64. But that's not all the squares that exist within this chessboard. If you take a look closer and you think out of the box, you can also make a square out of a 2 by 2 squares. For example, right here, that's 1. Going through this first row, I can make seven of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. At this point, I can't make another two by two, so there's only seven on this row. And if I do the same pattern, there are seven in the first column. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven by seven is 49, so I can add seven squared to this count. Now thinking out of the box again, instead of a 2x2, two two, I can do the same with a 3x3. Three three. There is a 3x3 three three square that I can make out of this chessboard. It's 1, 2, 3, and if I keep continuing that pattern, there's 6 of those 3x3 three three squares on the first row. Likewise, there are 6 3x3 three three squares on the first column, so I can add another 6 squared. If I keep repeating the pattern, if you look at the pattern, it's 8 squared, 7 squared, 6 squared. Each number is just going down by 1 and you're squaring that result. So if I were to continue this, I would get 3 squared plus 2 squared plus 1 squared. At the end, if you add all those up, that's the simplified version of it. And the final answer is 204. Hope you like this puzzle and I will have more for you in the future. But for now, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I just want to thank you for your support and watching my video. Click on this video here if you want to see some mental math tricks. If you want to check out some of our math raps, click on this video right here. Hope to see you soon.